Hi everyone, it's Akila. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And as you can see, today we are at the dentist because all the kids are being seen today. I just think it's way more convenient when I can get all the kids in. It did throw us off a little bit because I had to check the kids out of school early. Of course, they were really happy about that, but I also had to call off from work. So there's a substitute teaching my class right now. And I really hope that my class is not embarrassing me. I hope they're setting a really good example and behaving well. But anyways, we're probably going to be here for a pretty long time. So let's go ahead and get everyone checked in. Hi! Hello, welcome to Fun Gums, the funnest dentist in town. Can I please get a last name? Yes, uh, Collins. Okay, Collins, Collins. Oh, yep, I see it right here. You're just in time. Leonardo, Leah, and Olivia Collins, correct? Yes, that's them. Okay, so what you can do now is go ahead and grab a ticket from the dispenser on your left and Dr. Payne will call your kids in separately. Dr. Payne? Uh-uh, mommy. I don't want to go. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, that normally does kind of freak the kids out. He's really nice, I promise you. Mommy, I don't trust her. Let's go. Don't worry, it's okay. Uh, Leo, can you go ahead and grab a ticket as my hands are pretty full? Yeah, mom, I got you. Okay, let's go ahead and have a seat. I'm gonna try and calm Livy down because you guys can see she's very nervous. Um, hello, did you hear me, mommy? I said I wanna go. Livy, we're not going home. You'll be okay, I promise. I'm gonna go in with you and everything. Cause that makes it so much better. All right now, you can lose the attitude. I don't even know where you get it from. Livy, just listen to mommy. You're gonna be fine, I promise. Come on, let's go over here and play. Look, they have a bunch of toys and stuff. And really big dentures, like the one Grandma had in the cup. Ew, that's so nasty. You sit over there. Okay. Look, Mr. Bear, it's a friend for you. Hey, Mom, do you think you can hold this ticket now? Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Thanks, because I want to play my video game. video game why did you pack that in your bag and bring it to school i told you not to do that it could get stolen lost anything oh right um it was already in the car already in the car if you're gonna lie to me at least do a little better than that all right i'm gonna put this ticket down on the floor and i'm gonna just read this little magazine call the gums and friends and see if i can learn anything helpful we have a full lobby this afternoon can i please see uh leonardo collins oh okay so that's the kid's new dentist and he actually looks really nice okay so let me put my game away and I definitely don't need my mom to go in with me because that's low-key embarrassing. Um, hello, I'm sitting right here. I don't understand what's so embarrassing about your mom going with you, but... Okay, Leo, just let me know if you need something. Okay, mom. Hi, uh, that's me. Alright, perfect. Uh, you can go ahead and head into my office. I'm gonna speak to mom real quick. Okay. Hey, uh, you must be mom. Oh, hi, uh, Dr. Payne. Yep, that's me. Don't take it personally. When kids start getting this age, they do not want their parents going in. But don't worry, I'll let you know everything. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Dr. Payne. No problem, Mrs. Collins. All right, you could go ahead and just sit in the chair for me. And it looks like we'll be tightening your braces today. But before we get started, is there anything that's been bothering you? Uh, no, not that I can think of. Okay, well, if anything comes up, just let me know. And once again, my name is Dr. Payne, and 
I'm here to just make your life easier. If at any time you feel uncomfortable, if something hurts, just go ahead and lift up your right hand and I'll stop. All right, Dr. Payne, sounds good. I just cleared off the tray and now I'm gonna get the rest of my tools ready. So I'm gonna need this right here. Of course, my face covering. All right, Leo, let's go ahead and see these braces. So, of course, you've been through this before. Today, you'll also get to have the option to change your braces color. Um, is that something you'd be interested in, or do you want to keep the same color? I mean, it's a little hard to talk with this in my mouth, but I guess I'll keep the gray because it matches with everything. I know, a lot of my patients think it doesn't make sense, but... We talk to you so you don't feel so nervous, but you're doing just fine. Once again, just let me know if anything bothers you. Okay, so let's go ahead and start replacing those worn out bands. Let me know if anything feels uncomfortable. Uh, Mrs. Collins, could you uh, please step into my office? Oh yeah, of course. Is everything okay? How's he doing in there? Oh yes, everything's just fine. I just wanted you to see the progress we made. All right, so... For this appointment for Leonardo, what I went ahead and did was tightened his braces. You know, we replaced those bands. And by the looks of it, it seems like he should be able to get his braces off this summer. What? Finally? Oh wow, it feels like he just got them on. His teeth have made a substantial amount of progress and I'm really proud of how it's looking. Because if we take a look at the x-rays, we can see what his teeth looked like before the braces. Uh, there we go, it's up on the screen. Next time, I'm gonna need more of a trigger warning, Doc. Talk about a jump scare. Wow. As you can see, Leo's teeth were very, very overcrowded, and the braces have really helped, so just a couple more months and he should be good to go. That is wonderful news, I love to hear it. Thank you so much for the update. Of course, Mrs. Collins, if you could go ahead and just, uh, bring Leah into my office, that would be great. All right, let's go ahead and turn this off. Leo, you have been absolutely amazing. When I was taking a look at your file, I saw that you have been taking over-the-counter pain medications to relieve pain for your braces. So I went ahead and got you some Advil, and I would suggest taking that before the pain starts kicking in. Oh yeah, Advil is a lifesaver. Thanks, Dr. Payne. No problem. Okay, I'm so glad everything went well with Leo. And Leah, you're next, so would you like me to go in with you, or do you want me to stay out here in the lobby? Unlike somebody, I don't mind if you go in with me, Mom. Livy, I'll be right back. Leo, go ahead and keep an eye on Livy, okay? Don't worry, Mom. I got it. Okay, let's prep for Leah. So I'm going to put this in here so it can be sterilized later. Once again, I have my face covering on. We are going to need this. She's going to be here for a cleaning today. So let's get the rest of the tools for that. And we should be good to go. All right, Mrs. Collins, let me go ahead and pull up a seat for you. Thank you. And how are you doing today, Leah? Hi, Dr. Payne. I'm okay. Just okay? Okay, actually, I'm really excited because I have auditions coming up for ballet. I'm gonna nail my audition. I've been practicing nonstop. I'm gonna blow my dance teacher away because I absolutely love ballet. I have been doing it since I was three years old and it is the absolute best thing to ever exist. And okay, okay, maybe I shouldn't have asked. Uh, let's just go ahead and get this appointment started. So let's just go ahead and bring you up just a tad bit. Perfect. And let's see those pearly whites. Ooh, uh, yeah, you're definitely gonna need a cleaning. Oh my goodness, Leah, I thought I told you to brush your teeth at school. I packed you one of those to-go toothbrushes and everything. Sorry, Mommy, I forgot. Don't worry, it's totally fine. That's what you're here for. Besides all the gunk on your teeth, 
they're really straight. I did forget two of my items though, so one second. All right, let's switch these out. So this is gonna be the first thing I'm gonna use. That thing is scary and it hurt. Just like I told your brother, I am not here to hurt you. I'm here to simply just make your life better. And if anything hurts or feels uncomfortable, just go ahead and raise your right hand for me. But I understand you're nervous and I'm trying to be as gentle as I can while also being effective. Does it hurt? No. Okay, well, perfect. That means I'm doing my job correctly. Let's go ahead and just put this down on the tray. Wait a minute, what's that? I know this thing looks intimidating, but trust me, it's not. It actually just squirts out water. Here. See, nothing to be worried about. It's basically a water gun. There we go. Wow, Leah, your teeth look so much better. You did such an amazing job. Well, I've been doing this for over 20 years, so I'd hope so. So, uh, can you show me how you've been brushing? Uh-huh. It seems like you're rushing to beat the clock, when really, it's not a race. I understand you're probably brushing your teeth really fast and trying to get out the door when you're heading to school, but we want to make sure that we're really, really focusing on how we're brushing and how long we're brushing because we want to keep your teeth looking as beautiful as they look now. So here's how you should really be brushing. Electric toothbrushes are really good, but I can also recommend a small headed soft bristled toothbrush and you want to gently grasp it with your fingers you don't want to brush too hard because that can start making your gums bleed and that's something else you don't want so you want to sweep the brush gently back and forth over your teeth and gums in soft strokes and then after doing that a couple times you'll want to go in circular motions be sure to clean the spaces between your teeth and the sweeping motion helps to brush food and particles away from your gums. Make sure you're getting your teeth all the way in the back because those teeth are just as important. Those are your chewing surfaces. And of course, you can't forget to brush your tongue because that'll help with the way your breath smells. Not saying that you have bad breath or anything, but... I feel like a lot of people do not brush their tongue as much as they should. And of course, you can't forget to rinse and use your mouthwash. Well, you're definitely at the age where you can use regular mouthwash instead of the one for kids. Mom, before you guys leave, you can pick up some dental supplies behind the front desk. Okay, perfect. We will. Thank you. Okay, now I'm just going to check my work and make sure everything looks spotless. Great, great job, Leah. Remember those tips I gave you guys, okay? Okay, Dr. Payne, I definitely will. Okay, I'll go ahead and uh, bring the little one in. Perfect, I'll go ahead and get set up. You're finally done. How was it? It was actually really good, Livy. He's not scary at all. And look at my teeth. Don't they look really good? Yeah, they do, Leah. Okay, Livy, well... It's your turn now, so come on, let's get your little booty into the office. But I'm not ready. Well, you better get ready. Well, this must be Olivia. Uh, hello. Whoa, well, you don't look happy to be here. Well, neither do you. Oh, well, this one's got a little sass. Uh-huh, I was just talking about this. All right, Mom, let's put her in the chair. Okay. This chair is scary. No, it's not. Come on, let's get you in the chair. You see these buttons down here? Uh-huh. Well, if I uh, press them... That was fun. Do it again. One, two, three. That is the perfect height. Wait, I have a question. Go ahead, honey. What's the question? Why do they call you Dr. Payne? Are you gonna hurt me? Because my mommy will beat you up. Oh, she will? Most definitely. <laughs> well, uh, they call me Dr. Payne because that's my last name. Don't let it fool you. It's actually spelled P-A-Y-N-E. Not P-A-I-N. Well, I'm still learning how to spell anyways. 
You are just the cutest. Well, let's go ahead and see these teeth. Hmm, I think it would be best if we actually do some x-rays. So let me gather my equipment. Pat, I hate that thing. Mommy, what is an x-ray? He's just going to take a closer look at your teeth. It's not going to hurt, okay? Okay, you better not be lying to me. I'll take this from you, sweetie. You do not have to hold it. Now, I know this tool looks really big, but it's not going to hurt. I promise. I'm just going to need you to say, ah. I don't want to. Hmm. Well, how about we try it with your stuffed animal? Mr. Bear? Yes, uh, Mr. Bear. See, Mr. Bear is doing it just fine. He's been really brave. So, I know you can do it too. Yes, I can. Okay, Olivia, now this thing up here is going to come down. This is just a really big robot arm, and he's not going to hurt you, okay? Say hi, Mr. Robot. Hi, Mr. Robot. A one, two, three. What this is doing is taking a picture of your teeth. All right, and that should be all the pictures we need. So let's take this back, put it on the tray, and mom, if you want to turn around, you can see the x-rays. So we can uh, see her bottom teeth right there. Those look really good. They're coming in strong. And now if we take a look at the next picture, it's still loading in. Uh, let's give it a second. Uh, there we go. Okay. Is everything okay? Oh, there is a uh, decent sized cavity on her tooth. And her teeth aren't that big, so I can see it as clear as day. Go ahead and say ah again for me, sweetie. Ah! Oh, yeah, um, we're gonna have to treat this today. Don't worry, I'll take care of it. Everyone just stay calm. Okay, the first step is applying the numbing gel. I guess all that Easter candy wasn't the best idea. Okay, Olivia, let's go ahead and have you open your mouth again. I don't want that needle. I know it looks scary, but I promise it's not. It'll be over so quick. You just sit tight and squeeze onto Mr. Bear, okay? Okay, it seems like the woman was too stunned to speak. Let's go ahead and uh, put this back into your mouth, and here goes nothing. Owie, that hurt. It's okay, Livy. Honestly, I'm glad he didn't drag it out and just caught it over with. You said it wouldn't hurt. I'm so sorry, but I won't have to do it again, okay? Here, it's going bye-bye. Look. Oh, okay. Oh, I hate seeing the little ones cry. Okay, we're going to try to get through this fast. Something is wrong. I can't feel my face. Well, honey, that's what the numbing gel and the needle were for. So, this is the tool that I'm going to be using. I know it might look a little bit scary. I'm going to turn it on. It makes a really, really loud noise. But this is what we're going to use to get the cavity out your tooth. And you'll be able to feel the vibration, but it shouldn't hurt. And if it does hurt, just go ahead and lift Mr. Bear up, okay? And I promise you, I'll stop. Here, you can even hold the tool for yourself. See, it's not so bad. Alright, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, I saw Mr. Bear went up. Is everything okay? I just wanted to see if you were telling the truth. Okay, Olivia, let me go ahead and finish now. You're doing great. Have you heard of a show called Bluey? My grandchildren love that show. I love the theme song. Mom! Dad! Bingo! Bluey! And just like that, we are done. Oh, we can put this tool away. I'll just actually put it over here. The bluey thing always works with the kids. Okay. Scrape that out. This is a magic laser. 
All right, so let's apply that. You were so amazing, Olivia. Let's bring this chair down. Perfect. Here, let me help you. All of your children were very, very delightful, Mrs. Collins. No complaints at all. Thank you, Dr. Payne. I think they really enjoyed you too. Oh, well, thank you. If you feel like you have the time, please, please go ahead and write a positive review on Yelp. Okay, will do. Thank you, Mr. Payne. Of course, no problem. And if any of you kids have any concerns or need to come back for anything, just feel free to call up and make an emergency appointment, okay? Okay, sounds good. Thank you again. No problem. Have a good rest of your day. Good job, kiddos. I am so proud of you. Especially you, Livy. You are such a big girl. Thank you, Mommy. Okay, let me go ahead and pay. Okay, Mrs. Collins, I went ahead and put your total up on the screen. Just go ahead and insert your card. Okay, yep, everything looks good. So let me go ahead and tap to pay. Perfect. Great, everything went through. So here are a few gifts from Fun Gums. Of course, the mouthwash. And here is a free toothpaste as well. Well, that is going to be it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, please feel free to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. Once you are subscribed, click the bell button so you get notified whenever I post a video. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!